Shalom Aleichem, good morning. Every time that I'm thinking about this um, topic of, uh, of redemption, it keeps on waking me up to, to this important understanding that I feel a great urge to share with you on the way that the redemption will take place. And even though I said it a few times already before, and you probably also got it already, I think it's very important to understand the greatness of, of redemption, that there's going to be something so unique and special, the experience, except for the like fact that the goodness will shine and that everything will be good and everything will be good. We need to understand what it means. I, I have this very strong passion and understanding of the importance of me to explain how will it happen. So the awareness of the person that today is limited to the present time and the place we are located at. Because you're experiencing your life today only in the present time. And the next moment is also a moment of the present time. And the last moment that you experienced one moment ago is gone, is not there anymore. And you cannot even remember it fully. You cannot never in any way in the present time experience the past or the future. You will experience the future in the present time in a couple of minutes from now. And the past, you only experienced it in the present time when you were there a couple of minutes ago. But in the future to come, okay, so that's the aspect of time. And the place is as well now I'm driving, so I'm experiencing this spot, and now I'm experiencing a different angle, a different spot, and I cannot go back, and even if I'm going to go back to that spot, I won't be in the exact same place, and even if I'm going to be in the exact same place, I will not experience the same world, because everything around me is already different, everything evolved and changed. So you cannot experience another point twice, but in the time of redemption, the awareness and the access of our mind to different time spots will be different. All the barriers, all the, the, the separations will fall down and will not exist anymore. And exactly like that you're experiencing the now and the place that you are at right now in the, person, in the present time in the present, you're also experiencing the same present time in the place that you are at right now, in a different place in the present. So there is no better place to be, or there is no difference even between now and one minute ago and one minute from now, because in your experience, you're experiencing the same eternal time, present, time as the now but in the future to come you'll have access to feel all those moments together you will come back to the awareness of every moment that you ever experienced in your body in your lifetime in this lifetime and in the past also you're going to go back into the times that you were as a soul inside of a different body in the secret of lifetimes of reincarnation and you'll experience life and things in all those moments that you ever experienced before and not only that you're going to experience all those moments you're going to experience them to the depths 
to any angle, to any aspect of them, according to your need and your desire to search for the truth. If you will want to know about the plants, about the sky, about the weather, about the reasons for things, about the, the, the reasons that brought things to take place, the history, how things came to this place that they are at right now. When you will want to investigate those things, the awareness will not stop at the limitation that we are experiencing today. And you'll be able to travel into those places above time and above place. If you're gonna travel inside time to wherever you want. And you're gonna travel in physicality to wherever you want with your awareness. You'll be able to visualize things, to experience them in different ways, from different angles, from the depths of them. And all that experience will be experienced in that time of present that you experienced them when you were there. But not only that, just also that you're going to experience the moment of redemption in all those points in time and in place. Means that if I can like roughly say that you lived seven billion moments or seven billion moments and five you're gonna experience those moments as a person that is being redeemed in all those moments the redemption will not going to be only now when you're 43 or tomorrow when you're going to be 44 or yesterday when you were 21. The redemption will take place in all those times that you ever experienced. The Creator will redeem every and any moment for any creation means that even the sidewalks will experience the redemption in all the moments. The redemption is above time. It's not that the future will be corrected. It's that the creation will be crea created from, from scratch. New sky, new land, new ground, new reality, new supervision. But to any moment, to any part of our lives in an eternal aspect of them. We're going to experience the redemption and in the time of redemption the wisdom will cover the world like water covers the sea. The knowledge will expand to that extent. Kamaim layam mechasim as water covers the sea means that you have access to any corner, to any angle, to any place inside the ocean, like a person who swims, like a fish who swims. It's big, I guess, I think, and it's important for me to mention. I hope you understand it right, and that it's impacting you in a positive way, like it is for me. Be well. You know me, my name is RDMC with the Muna Project. All the nations with me, close your eyes, just breathe, see the truth. Don't chase the fake world, don't buy the fake news. Be yourself, your own true self. Don't let no one take our natural wealth. See the good, no fear, no despair. Cherish who that you are. Source of power from an endless spring, light up courage in yourself. You they can you kick you down, down to the ground, hold yourself up till you are put up your crown. King of the Creator, Holy Soul inside, focus on the spiritual and you shall.